let's continue on. So I did a little bit of practice. I think I have the timing for these giant assholes down. That's fucking cool. <laughs> I mean, it's not the most powerful thing because I haven't upgraded Fidget once, but it at least looks cool. Also, I can do this. That is at least a lot of cool fire. And it's a good stun. Uh, okay, so we have to get past Oh, a level. Cool. I was hoping I'd get another one soon. Um, you know what? I say we go with Fidget, because... I have a feeling we're going to be using that. I should go for defense. Um, I have a feeling we're going to be using her stuff. Away from that. See, that's the one bad thing. So if there's just no enemies wherever it decided to go, that means that's the end of that. Still got healing stuff. This is the asshole we have to pass. Alright. Come on. Okay. Okay. I I didn't even try to attack that time. I hit bumper. There we go. There we go. See any more? Some you assholes. Please drop something more than the mushroom. Just say please drop it something more than the mushroom. That's never gonna happen. Oh, that's a oh, I never noticed the uh, like when you get like a big hit, the mush, the background mushrooms and stuff like. Oh, you guys have killed me. Yeah. Your asshole. Electricity bullshit killing me. Oh yeah. <laughs> I remember that now. Wait, why why change all the What happened? Okay, let me get out of the red and then this time. I don't know what happened there. Oh, it goes behind too. Okay. Well now I know. Just need to get what? What? No, really. What the fuck is that? All right. Why is there a uh, whatever? Oh come on! Fidget is something wrong. What? Oh, silence. She's been silenced, Dust. While in this state, she will be unable to cast her projectiles. Fortunately, the effect is only temporary and will fade over time. You mean Fidget can't talk now? At all? That's terrible. Really awful. Not sure how I'll get by. Okay, my, my main issue with that is... If you know Fidget's annoying, then it's no longer like a parody or something. Because if you're just being the thing, it's not a parody, it's just annoying. Also, there's a slight slow- I didn't notice before. Slow down a little bit when you uh, really hope one of these guys drops. Like a mysterious wall chicken or something. Uh, or a, a shopkeeper would be nice, but I know that's not going to happen. Alright, so we at least saved. Thank you. No! Go away! 
Oh, cool. You drop food. There he goes. Forget him. Take a look around. There's something horribly wrong with these mushrooms. Oh, wow. Yeah, these I didn't even notice. mushrooms, Fidget. They are called bubble sprouts, and it would be wise for us to tread lightly around them. They react rather explosively to movement. Wonderful. Oh. Okay. Well, let's, um... I know it doesn't give a shit for health, but it's literally better than nothing. So we just have to worry about that poison. Oh, come on. Oh, boy. Oh, no, 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 no. This area is bullshit. No, I missed the shopkeeper. Shit. Get up there. Come on. Okay, good. What are you buying? I am here to serve. Alright, so... First off, give me, uh, uh buh, cures one health. <laughs> Fuck you. Let's go grab four. Do you have anything new? That's got defense. I'll take a luck hit for defense. Honest. Like... It's worth it. Oh wow. Master Ring of Vigilance would be cool too, but Your trend. Well, item drop rate would be nice. Um First off. Cause there's gonna be a boss event. And I don't know what we're gonna do against them. Oh god, I'm going back, aren't I? No I'm not, I'm going forward. Okay. Yay, save point. Boo, can't go forward. Okay, let's, uh... Oh! I tried to dodge, but I didn't hit it fast enough. Everything is all melty and weird, and I like it. This is such a cool looking area. Because they have about too many games, but they're also pretty. Video games are pretty. Did you know video games are actually really pretty? Like, a lot of the time. Like, everybody talks about how shitty, like, games look and stuff. But video games are really pretty. <laughs> See, that's what it's good for right now, is that amazing fucking stuff. It knocks them into the air. Okay, so I can't go through here. There should be a timer. Battle will be over. You no know shit. This is not even. Oh, oh god. Oh no, this is over. Yep, I'm fucked. I can't even tell because the light. I can't even tell what's going on. Because the inverted... Oh god, this is gonna suck. I'm already a third through the game, though. I'm already a third through the game. We can do this. We killed that first one quick. If we can just get them both, this will be over quick. Can I... Um... Picking on There's no way of huh? skipping. Most definitely oh, he 
Yeah, no, this is over really fast. Oh, hey, got that off. Um, uh, what? What happened? I don't even... Yeah, I don't even know what happened there. I, I guess the... I guess there was one that I didn't... I don't know. I have zero idea what happened there, so... Uh, let me just beat this really quickly. There he is! Ah! Leave me! Picking on... again. You're welcome, kid. Well, shit. <laughs> oh, now, Dust, he's obviously terrified. Let's go find him, and maybe get out of this raining death. Oh, God. I am almost dead, and I, I don't have anything else to heal poison now. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, sheep. Hey, sheep. Okay, that's what the sheep's from. We got to mud pot. I didn't think those monsters were smart enough to build a fence. I'm certain they didn't. Let's hop on over. I always test if you can kill the animals. It's just kind of a habit. Your father's done gonna have himself a heart attack after he hears about this. I'm sorry, Mama. Goodness, what would I do if you'd gotten yourself hurt? Ah, Mama, look! Those things must have followed me! How'd they jump my fence? Crafty vermin, those surface dwellers. She does see that I can fly, right? I'll be sure to tell her, Fidget. I'm sure that'll clear things right up. Back! Back, you beast! I got this ear spoon and I ain't afraid to use it! We aren't here for trouble, ma'am. In fact, we just saved your son. Huh? What are they talking about, Bobo? Um, well, they have been following me for a while. What? How far out did you go? I may just save the spoon for you. Uh, I'm sorry. We just came down from the surface to... Do I look like some country bumpkin to you? Of course you're from the surface. I think I'd remember seeing a talking, flying weasel cat thing down here. I think we got off on the wrong foot here. My name is Dust, and this is Fidget. Some creatures attacked a village above these caves, and we're trying to figure out why. Attacked a surface village, you say? Well, if that don't beat all, we underground folk tend to keep to ourselves. Got enough problems of our own already. I'm sorry to hear that. Actually, what I'm saying is... We got enough problems of our own without you surface folk bringing all that nonsense down here. So, if you don't mind... Come on, Dust. We're obviously not wanted here. Wait! That's enough, Bopo! You ought to get back to your chores before I take out the spoon again! Mama, I've seen them fight! They even got themselves a talking sword! I bet they could help! Young man, I don't care if their sword spouts rainbows and bowls of delicious baked beans. I don't want their help. Stop saying that! Pa's gonna die if we don't do something! 
die? What's going on? Well, our healing wells have gone and run dry. And my pa's done gotten real sick. That's why I went out. To find some more of that water. I hate saying it, but it's true. See these mud pots lying around? Normally they're bubbling to the brim with mineral water. But just a few weeks ago, they dried up to nothing. Well, that sucks. But that still don't excuse you from putting yourself in danger like that! I may not be able to help your father, but I sure as heck ain't gonna lose you too! Mama! I wonder if those monster attacks on the surface could be related to your wells drying up. I wouldn't be at all surprised. It's been a couple weeks since the water dried up, but every creature here is feeling the effects. I'll bet those creatures broke through to the surface looking for more water. Mama, maybe these two can go talk to the lady. The lady? Oh, she's a sweet old soul. Lives deep in the caves, makes the waters flow. She doesn't show herself around here too often, and we can't actually go see her on account of all the nasties living between here and there. In that case, I'll go speak with this lady and see why she stops the flow of water. You do that? Well, why not? This can't all just be a coincidence. The attacks on the surface, your wells drying up. I'm certain this lady must know something about what's going on. Well then, I had you folks pegged all wrong. If you aim to help my husband, I promise not to clock you with my wooden spoon of justice. Um, thanks? So, you're... We'll do ah, our best, dang it. Popo. Sorry. Just don't go running off again. You got my word. Okay. There's no... There's no... There's no, uh... Yeah. This isn't good. Oh, wait. Didn't I buy... I bought a ring. Or I guess I didn't buy the ring. No, I didn't have enough for the ring. That's what it was. Ooh, it's a pretty kitty cat. What? Me? It's a flying cat! She's not a cat, little girl. She's a... I don't even know what she is. I'm not a cat, you dolt. I'm a nimbat. Is that what you're called? A nimbat? Yes, hello. My name's Fidget. Maybe we've met? Can I hold it? I want it. Just do something! It's trying to grab me with its little child hands. That's actually how I feel most of the time. Don't worry, Fidget. Sorry, um, um what's your name? Smobop. <laughs> well, Smobop, I'm sorry, but as much as she might look like one, Fidget is not a toy. Hey! Oh, I want her! She talks! I'll trade you. Look, I've got this box thing. Hey, Dust, look! That must be Reed's box! Hmm, tell you what, next time I go to the surface, I'll see if I can find a suitable replacement. Then we'll trade. Phew, good idea, Dust. You know that shop in Aurora had some things. Maybe the shopkeeper could figure something out for us? Yeah, maybe he can make us some kind of fidget doll for her. After all, she's far too young to take care of a pet like you. <laughs> yeah, way too much responsibility for... Hey! Yeah! Okay. So, I don't know where I'm supposed to go, but... I'm assuming up here, because this is a path. What's this? Oh. Hello, dear. I'm going to hazard a guess that you're the outsider in town. No, I've lived here for 20 years. How, how have we not met? I stand out that much, huh? Well, it's been years since I've seen someone like you. And it's been maybe 30 years since I've seen a nimbat like your friend here. What a treat! We don't like flying into caves. You know, the dark, the cramped spaces, the endless, endless gloom. That's endless. 
Forever? I'm sorry. Look at me going on. My name is Flo Hop, and my husband Gappy is up there in the pen minding the sheep. He's been so overworked that I was hoping to make him his favorite stew. But to be honest, I'm having trouble growing red moss with the wells running dry. I think I might have gone and made my last stew. I could always help you find some of that red moss, if you like. Oh, I couldn't bother you for something as silly as that. I know where they used to grow, but with all these monsters about, I dare not leave Mud Pot. It's no trouble, really. If I come across any, I'll bring them to you. Well, aren't you a sweet one? Red moss clumps grow at the base of the large red mushrooms, and they tend to prefer perfect darkness. Just don't hurt yourself on my account. In fact, take this ring. It'll provide a little bit of light in the darkest of places. All right. Shoot. Let's see, this is the worst one. Oh, hey. Oh. So that, okay. So I do have the ring and scavenger. Okay, I'm fine with that. Let's see what else is up. You have a quest too, jeez. Well, good evening, youngin. How does anyone know what time of day it is down here? I'm gonna put this on auto advance again. I hear the two of you are helping out Pope Pop. He's in a bad way. Excuse me, my friends. Hope you don't mind, but I gotta get back to searching. Did you lose something? Actually, I did. I must have left the gate open, because my flock of sheep seems to have gone astray. I'm afraid some of them may have gone past the edge of town. I'll keep my eyes open for them. Well, thank you, son. There's six of them out there somewhere. Believe you me, they're in for a good talking to when I get my hands on them. Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go to defense this time. Oh, yeah. I can see the... Oh, there's a graveyard. Okay, so we can't dash under, which means that there's a thing later, I'm guessing, that gives us that. Oh, we can go straight up here. <laughs> 